Mr. Moore attacked me when I was a child. And now the son of that lady, Beverly Young Nelson, is speaking to CBS 42. CBS 42 news reporter Michael Clark tonight is live in Gadsden. Now, Michael Nelson's son says that his mom is back here in Alabama after that emotional news conference on Monday. Yeah, that's right. Spencer Harris said he talked with her last night after she got home and that she's just been torn up. Some have doubted her claims on social media. Roy Moore has denied the allegations, but like his mother, Harris wants to see Roy Moore do that under oath. I thought that he was going to rape me. With tears in her eyes this week, Beverly Young Nelson got in front of cameras in New York to allege Alabama Senate candidate Roy Moore tried to sexually assault her when she was a teenager. It was really sad for me to kind of see her on TV, you know, just breaking down like she did. Nelson's son, Spencer Harris, says after the news conference, he heard Roy Moore deny knowing his mom or the location of the restaurant where she says it happened behind the building. He uh, claims he doesn't even know my mother, but, you know, he signed her yearbook. Roy Moore's brother, Jerry, and some on social media have doubted the signature's authenticity, but Harris says he's proud of his mom for speaking out, stands behind her words, and has his own questions for Roy Moore. She's challenged him to go under oath and uh, challenged him for a polygraph, and um, I believe, you know, if, if he will do that, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll see. Now, you heard Roy Moore's lawyer earlier ask about taking a look at that yearbook. Long before that press conference, I asked Harris if his mother might allow us to take a look at it. But so far, we haven't heard an answer. We're now reporting live in Gadsden. Michael Clark, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.